You didn't disappoint, did you? You've done well. Seems only fair I answer any questions weighing on you. Go on. Ask away. What can I say? Not many people bother with this place. Luckily for me, you were different. Knew I was right to bet in favor of the Arisen. Anyway, most visitors get fooled into going up to the manor. We send them packing with a trifle, and if they don't question it, good riddance. Anyone that complacent has got no business being a thief. We only train the rare few who make it here. Some might go so far as to say that the entire village was built around this spot. That all you wanted to ask? Aye. Till next time, then. Time to be heading home. A bit quiet, but I like it. hard, but dreams are free, I think. It is quiet, though. Take joys back. That all you wanted to ask? Aye. Till next. One day, I'm going to have proper raiment. Greetings, Master. Is this where you've been all this while? Our party is reunited. Surely we can ask for no more than that? Well met, sir. How might I be of service? Follow me. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. No harm in picking a few. Weapons are simple enough to procure if we've the coin, but we might be lucky enough to find some in treasure chests. Right you are. While in another world, I happened upon a treasure chest rather close by here. Perhaps I could show you the way? Look! A treasure chest! We shall have to find a way to reach it. generally used as a material. Different combinations of materials result in different creations. A 
Perhaps this will seem of little consequence, but the pawns in this party are women all. And yet no two of us are the same. I'll gather these now. It would be a shame to forget their location when we need them most. We've a choice of where to go, but how to know the path best travelled? Do we decide based on our experience or trust to our instincts? to visit a campsite as yet, methinks. Time spent camping isn't necessarily time wasted. Come to think of it, the private quarters of one arisen I served had many a visitor, and rarely the same one. Fascinating. You can count on me to fly to your aid in your hour of need, Master. Knowing when to use curatives is my... have my support. I suspect the lad's enthusiasm will go a long way toward inspiring his peers. Let us inform the Baron. I don't know where that person can be found, Master. This way. feel so alive.
is a fair reward. We cannot complain. I suspect the lad's enthusiasm will go a long way toward inspiring his peers. Let us inform Sir Baron of his coming. I know where that person can be found, Master. This way. We're in your hands, sir. Much of love. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. Shall we see if there's all to be found while we're here? <laughs> what a view! Oh, I'd not say no to a short repose hereabouts. It would be a good place to take stock of our surroundings. It's no great shock to me. Weapons are simple enough to procure if we've the coin, but we might be lucky enough to find some in treasure chests. You have my support.
curious how a fine meal makes your eyelids heavy and not your stomach. Did anyone else see that? Ought catches the light. We ought to take a closer look. Oh, -ho! I'd not have thought we'd find one here. A splendid discovery. Ha! I'll have to remember to tell my own master about this. I would have preferred not to have to fight so soon. But at least I know I am up to the challenge. Try not to get hit, lest all that vim go to waste. There's a campsite nearby, if memory serves. I catch there myself in another world. Shall I lead the way? Naught spurs the imagination like places yet unvisited. We ought not to let caution halt our conquest, nor curiosity <laughs> These fiends will resurrect so long as their souls remain intact. But fear not, I shall gladly smash every last one. Got a good feeling about this one. I hope we've a plentiful supply of curatives. We'll be needing them as we've no mange. Incidentally.
a hidden path? I suppose there will be monsters lurking beyond it. Pray keep your wits about you. We needn't go barging in. Weapons are simple enough to procure if we've the coin, but we might be lucky enough to find some in treasure chests. You have my support. Ah, I'll take that. We might find a use for it. Not compares to the thrill of victory. I cannot help but feel indomitable. I suspect the lad's enthusiasm will go a long way towards inspiring his peers. Let us inform this baron of his own. Yes, I know just where to find this person. Follow me. The guide is most welcome. Now we shan't lose our way. One of our number is unconscious. their own impatience. We fight. To arms. No call here. I suspect the lad's enthusiasm will go a long way toward inspiring his peers. Let us inform Sir Baron of his coming. Follow me, Master, a few words. I'll bring you to the one you seek. Most welcome. Now we shan't lose our way. if all we do is make camp. It is enough to make camp only when the need arises.
While in another world, I happened upon a treasure chest rather close by here. Perhaps I could show you the way. useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. No harm in picking a few. Ooh, I can't wait to find out what's inside. are simple enough to procure if we've the coin, but we might be lucky enough to find some treasure chests. You have my support. I was hoping for. Have you forgotten something arisen? You're looking rather lost. I suspect the lad's enthusiasm will go a long way toward inspiring his Let us inform the very Reach our destination if you continue in that direction, Master. But I suppose I can guide us there later. 
Tis not for us to gain Savior Risen's judgment. We must go where we are bid. The lad's enthusiasm has a long way toward inspiring his peers. Let us inform the Baron. I may master a few words. I'll bring you to the one you seek. The light is most wrong. Now we shan't lose our way. Might I interest you in my humble wares? Tis an easy travelling out in the world all alone. Hope to see you again. Nothing caught your eye? Oh, that's a shame. Let's hope there's... Weapons are simple enough to procure if we have the coin. But we might be lucky enough to find some in treasure chests. It's no great shock to me. The arisen has been changed! Look! Oxen! How tranquil! I suspect the lad's enthusiasm is a long way toward him. Borrowing his <laughs> Let us inform the Baron of his name. <laughs> master a few words? I'll bring you to the one you seek. A guide is most welcome. Now we shan't lose our way. Forgotten rift stone we've not discovered lies nearby. Tis this way, as I recall, from my last sojourn beyond the rift. If we are to break it, it shan't be from this side. Really? Now? Materials such as this can be combined to craft things. I'm sure we'll find a purpose for it in due time. Unless I am much mistaken. We have caused to visit a place not far from here. Shall we head there now? Twould save us having to make the trip again. What's this crowd's going to be troublesome? Let's be on my guard. My head and need a few things. To break the law is to be thrown in jail. I've heard that jailers are paid a pittance, despite the hardships of their work. Then we'd best keep some coin on hand to ease our potential warders' suffering and make them an ally to our cause. Tidings, friend. How have you been keeping? As for me, I made the most of my week-long sojourn. One might even say I enjoyed myself overmuch. 
You see, I grew so fond of the destination my feet carried me off to, me thinks I should like to live there. And that's when I thought, mayhap you've grown just as fond of this dwelling. Fond enough to purchase it from me? I can't just give it to you, mind. I've my relocation costs to consider, but I'd sell it to you cheap as I can afford. Well, friend, what say you? Much obliged, friend. I hope you're as pleased with our deal as I am. This little dwelling's all yours now. Suppose I'd best be off. I've my own home to get to. I hope you'll be happy here, friend. Farewell. Someone is looking this way. Is there aught about me that caught their eye? What did you think of that story? It was well told and all, but not particularly exciting, eh? I mean, it's the sort of thing you hear bandied about the tavern every other night, isn't it? I'd heard tell of a beggar doing well for himself, so I came out here to learn his ways. Haven't learned much, that's for sure. And by the look of it, he doesn't appear to be making much for his efforts, neither. So where's all his coin coming from, then? Makes a man wonder it does. Oh, there's something written here. Let's have a look, then. That's it. I've had enough. Clear off. And don't come back till you're ready to do business properly. But I've got the coin, I swear it. I simply just... Where is it then, eh? Bring the coin, all of it, or I'll call the sentinels on you again. Are we clear? The lad seemed rather ignorant of the world. Hasn't had anyone to show him the prop. Oh, tis you. You're a welcome sight. Forgive my boldness, but I've a small favor to ask of you. Would you be willing to lend me some gold? I swear you'll be repaid in full. A trinket in yon shop caught my eye. A small, ornate box of exceptional craftsmanship. Alas, twould seem I do not have the coin on hand to purchase it. I can certainly procure the gold later, but by then, the box might be gone. If you'd be kind enough to lend me the amount I need, I would repay every last coin. Yes? Is there aught I can do for you? Or could it be that you've reconsidered my request? You... You bought it for me. Thank you. I'll treasure this. You're a kind soul. Pray, let me return the favor someday. He seems a young man of decent character. I believe his promise to repay your kindness was a genuine one. How might I be of service? I'm afraid I must be going now. Thank you again for your aid. Weapons are simple enough to procure if we've the coin. Fancy a look at my wares? In my line of business, patience is key. Do come again. A treasure chest. Shall we see if we can't make our way over to it? Now here's a welcome sight. I swear I've not blinked once in the last hour. 
ox carts make for relatively safer travel. One hopes these carts offer comfort commensurate to their costs. This ox cart's bound for Melv. I'll not take you anywhere till I've had my due. myself. There you are. Down in the forest. You will share my desolation and my hunger. This ladder looks sturdy enough to climb. Perhaps new discoveries await us above. find one. At least all our efforts weren't for naught. Ha! Ah, I'll have to remember to tell my own master about this. a lesson in determination. Somehow I knew you'd come. 
You have my gratitude as well, sir. Ulrika, glad I am to see you unharmed. You must return to the village. Everyone is concerned for you. Forgive me. I'd best go. But I shan't forget this. Thank you. Truly. That wasn't the dragon, but a poor imitation of it. No wonder I feel so hollow. Sigurd. You're the current Arisen, aren't you? I pray you do not walk the same path as I have. Tis a style all my own. A patchwork of techniques honed for the sole purpose of slaying the dragon. I wasn't sure we'd survive that, but here we are. My thanks. I. What can I do for you? Ah, a letter from Lady Margaret, you say? It is a fair way you've come, then. My thanks. She's a kindly sort, I must say. We met when I worked with her husband, Sir Gregor, on one occasion. Now she's taken to inquiring after my health at the turn of every season. Our results are awaited. What say we make our... That Lady Margaret's a kindly sort. We met when I worked with her husband, Sir Gregor, on one occasion. It's this way. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. Shall we see if there's ought to be found while we're here? Weapons are simple enough to procure if we've the coin, but we might be lucky enough to find some in treasure chests. I quite agree. Arisen. Pray. A flock of harpies draws near. We have no means of exploiting our enemy's weakness. You have no one might have expected. Should your pack grow over full, have no fear.
Well met. Have you any weapons for me? Good of you to go to the trouble. Many thanks. We'll gladly make use of what you've given us. I've you to thank for that new recruit, I. The lad's well eager, he is. He fears naught, and he follows my commands with nary a word of complaint. Soldiers like him boost the morale of all around them. His presence bodes well, and I've you to thank for it. There's just one problem. Seeing a lad so spirited, so foolhardy, makes me recall a time when I was much the same. Sets my blood to boiling, you see. Makes me yearn for a bout with a skilled combatant. Need I explain further? I test my steel against yours, friend. What say you? Care to spar with me a bit? Glad to hear it. Follow me, then. Think of it like a game. Whoever steps out first, loses. Simple enough, eh? Seeing as you're no warrior, you do well to strike when I'm off balance. Let's begin. Fight well! Well fought. You're even stronger than I'd anticipated. I dare say I needed that. You've my thanks. I've ne'er met anyone like you. You've done more for me this past while than anyone I've known as heir trouble to. A commendable sort you are. Would that I had some way to repay you for all the good you've done me. Sir Baron, you must come, and quickly! A goblin pack has descended over by the rope bridge. We're in need of your aid! My thanks for the report. I'll go at once. Goblins can be dastardly. We'll have need of capable fighters. The more, the better. I'd fain have you up my side, friend, if you'd be willing to join the fray. Quick! Over here! I thought you might like this, so I picked it up. Here you go. among our ranks, we've no one to heal us in times of need. Battle may be trying without someone to cure our wounds. But for now, we shall just have to manage.
We have found a material. Different combinations of materials result... Randall! What happened? Speak to me, lad! Sir, we managed to fell the goblins, but then a cyclops charged us out of nowhere, wounded and enraged. We stuck the beast with arrows till one of them pierced its eye. It fled, but I've no doubt to a return. Now mind that, lad. You survived, and that's what counts. Let's get you back to the encampment, aye? Right? It would seem my days of peace are at an end. Do you recall the soldier we met on the road? He was rather badly injured in the goblin melee. They'll want me to take responsibility for that, I just know it. Shan't be long before I'm forced to resign from my post. I doubt such a thing would be asked of any human instructor. But I'm beastern, aren't I? There's no fighting it. But I'll be damned if I let the troops suffer on my account. In the time that remains to me, I'll get them trained up as best I can. The fiends were fouled, yet a Perrin will be made to suffer all the same. This shan't go down well. This seems a decent spot for a campsite. Mayhap we ought to return for a rest when we're in need of one. We've got goblins! Give it to me! 